Hello lovely people. Hey, we're gonna jump right into this video and I'll be using some Hydro Beauty Micro Serum by Chanel followed by the Le Lift Serum also by Chanel. Then I'll be going getting underneath my eyes with this Le Lift Eye Cream also by Chanel. Next, I'll be applying Youth to the People Superfood Air Whip Moisture Cream. You always want to ensure that your face is nice and moisturized. Now I'm face rolling my face and taking out all the knots and smoothing out my lymphatic system. Then I'll be going in with a glossier. And you can get this kit from www.killercosmetics.com. Then I'm using this NYX Plump Right Back Primer. And then lightly etching on my eyebrows with Anastasia Beverly Hills Eyebrow Wiz. Using it Bye Bye Under Eye Concealer to carve out my eyebrows. I'll be correcting my skin with LA Girls Orange Corrector and Tarte Tape Shape in Tan Sand. Mixing those two together and patting that in. Next, I'll be mixing some Tarte Marhuja Oil mixed with some Dior Forever Skin Glow Foundation for my coverage. Also using a stippling brush to stipple everything in. Just pat lightly. P. Louise base one on my eyelids and I set that with Laura Mercier. Use these two Jaclyn Hill palettes. Ring the Alarm and also Divine Neutrals. It's a Jaclyn Hill and Morphe collection. I then went in with this Tammy Revolution palette. It's a Tropical Twilight 28 Pan eyeshadow palette. I used the color Glow, going over that with some Urban Decay Moon Dust. I'll be going in with this Patrick Ta, she's a doll, the cream side, mixed with milk, lip and cheek work. Spraying my face with Peach and Lily Glass Skin Veil after I place my contour. I used Black Opal Total Coverage for contour and also it Bye Bye Under Eye Concealer to conceal. Then I'm blending that all out with my Beauty Blender and my contour brush. Very, very slightly stipple in your blush and then go ahead and set everything with Laura Mercier. So before I set my face with Laura Mercier, I go in with Charlotte Tilbury Loose Setting Powder around my eyes and nose. Then I go back in with Laura Mercier Translucent Powder and then go in with some MAC Studio Fix Plus Powder. And then I'm using Medium Plus Mineralized Skin Finisher just underneath my eyes and then I'll be using Dark mineralized skin furniture around the parameters of my face and to contour my nose further more. To finish off my blush, I'm going in with this Patrick Ta, the powder side, and that is in She's a Doll. Then I soften out that pink with this Sephora Trio face palette. And there you have it. This is my completed look. Hope you found this video informative and let me know if you have any questions. Like, comment, share, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel at Killer Cosmetics.